Yo ho, Matt here. Hi, welcome to another session on the artist's way. So today we are continuing to unpack the notion that we started to explore yesterday that Julia calls the virtue trap. And as we, well, just as a reminder, um, what the virtue trap is, is how we get caught on the treadmill of virtuous production in service for others while we passively give up our individual sovereignty and in the process lose connection with ourself and that is why as julia says the artist in us feels vexed angry out of sorts if such deprivation continues our artist becomes sullen depressed hostile we eventually become like cornered animals snarling at our family and friends to leave us alone and stop making unreasonable demands. But as we have explored and taken ownership of, the we are the ones that are making the unreasonable demands because we are expecting our artist to be able to play and express without giving it the time and space to do so. And that is the virtue trap. So, um, I would assume that if you have time to watch this video, then you have the interest to nurture your artist child. So if you haven't already, let's go ahead and do just that with our morning pages. Okay, so. One way we so easily fall into this virtue trap um, is, as Julia calls it, making nice. It's so easy to want to just be, you know, oh, the person who just is so helpful. And um, for our artists, these virtuous ideals of serving others to the degree of neglecting ourselves can be very deadly. And so um, today's creative exercise is a fun way to explore and observe ways you've been sabotaging the artist from what it really wants and needs, um, which is in morning page fashion, just to speed write 19 wishes. Just I wish and then fill in the blank. I wish I had time to explore the Pacific coastline. I wish I played with my ancestors' cuisine more. I wish I spent time creating herbal remedies. Whatever, whatever, whatever. So enjoy that and see what surfaces. Um, tomorrow we are going to tie the bow on this virtuous trap section. So thank you so much for sticking in there as we've explored what isn't initially the most fun thing to focus on, but you know just as well as me that the freedom and the joy and the creativity that lies on the other side of this self-sabotage of the virtue trap um, is why we're here, is why we're, it's a, it's a well-worthy adventure. So enjoy creating the space for your list of wishes today. And I would love to hear from you in the comments and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow as we finish up the final session of recovering a sense of possibility. Peace, love, and wish.